I was talking to him on the phone because now I consider him a friend. And I was like, I'm not doing this whole relationship thing. I'm focusing on my career and I'm getting my stuff in order. I said the next serious relationship that I have will be my husband. When I want something, it's, you know, I'm gonna, gonna do whatever it takes in order to, to get it because that's the desire of my heart. And so his response was, oh, well, I guess I'm just gonna have to marry you then. That's what he said. I'm so honored to stand here with you today, recommitting my vow to you, to love, honor, and cherish you, and I wouldn't want to experience it with anyone other than you. You know, you gotta, you gotta make, it, you know, make a choice. You have to draw the line in the sand and say, okay, I'm not gonna cross this. At this time, Michael and Charmaine and we'll have a sand ceremony where they will combine the sand that they actually collected 14 years ago on their honeymoon. So just going through, I just felt more and more confident the closer the time came, and I think that had to do with the confidence that he had from the very beginning. With all my heart, 14 years later, with every ounce of my being, I can truly say that you're a gift from God to me. I knew her ambitions and her dreams when we first got together, and I said, hey, well, come on, like, let's, let's go for it. That's what we did. But when you can actually see that it's a goal achieved, that you said, then you appreciate it, I think, in a different way.